Alright, so this uh, video is about the NanoSurf EasyScan 2 software used to operate the um, EasyScan uh, Educational Atomic Force Microscope. That's the first thing we're going to talk about is um, operation of this microscope, then we're going to get into using the software and actually scan one of the samples that we use in our senior characterization lab. So I typically start off this characterization lab by running this slideshow, telling the students that we have a uh, silicon cantilever. So that's this uh, metal piece right here, the main body of the cantilever, with a backing of aluminum. You can see it's kind of a speckled uh, layer on the back. This is for the reflectivity of the laser, infrared laser. And then we have a silicon nitride tip on the end of this cantilever and that's what we use to do our scanning probe technique. Um, this could also be diamond and they have various shapes and radius of curvature at the end of these cantilevers, um, at the end of the tips. And the basic principle is that atomic force microscopy is one of uh, several scanning probe microscopy techniques. Uh, the main characterization of, of atomic force is that we're keeping the force constant whereas in other techniques we may keep other things constant. Um, this cantilever uh, is at a certain angle and as the tip hits certain features that cantilever will bend. The laser will therefore be um, uh, reflected at a different angle and the piezo crystal uh, is actually in our system mounted above the cantilever and will respond to this deviation in laser position 